Hello, I'm Tom Andrews, and once again, we're here with Missy Buttram of HomeWire Realty. Uh, you founded HomeWire in 2013, and this real estate company is not your typical real estate company. You guys have your fingers in a whole lot of pies. Why don't you tell me all the things you do, first of all, with HomeWire? So HomeWire primarily is a brokerage. Uh, first and foremost, we work with buyers and sellers in the traditional aspect. I'm out selling homes, I'm out with buyers, finding homes. That's our primary purpose. But along with my husband, when we founded this, we started working on flips. We'll buy unwanted homes, fix them up, sell them. Um, we started in the modular home business, couldn't find enough inventory for people. So we started creating some of our own inventory. Um, we also work with investments, Airbnbs and long-term rentals kind of have our hands in whatever real estate there is. One of the programs that HomeWire is involved with that you may not have heard of is called Just Bliss It. And it's designed to help people who are having some trouble selling their home for whatever reason. Missy, tell me a little bit about Just Bliss It. Exactly what do you guys do? So Just Bliss It derived from my team name, Team Bliss, to just bliss your home. Your home might be kind of ugly, unsellable, outdated, it's got some peeling paint, some situations where maybe the um, financing couldn't go through. Maybe mm -hmm. you've had it in the market and tried mm -hmm. and it's just not selling. So what we're going to do is we're going to partner with you to make the most money out of your biggest asset. Well, let's say a home seller needs help with finding contractors to repair, to do maintenance. How does that work and how do you step in? So my husband and I have access to those contractors and access to the money to make those things happen. That's usually the biggest concern with home sellers is they don't have the time or the money to be doing those repairs. And it's really important that repairs are done so that it's financeable to clients coming in, buyers coming in, that they can use their financing. Um, we're finding homes with peeling paint, um, outdated electricity, um, maybe the flooring's ripped up, the bathroom's not working, there might be some plumbing leaks. So just deferred maintenance that really should get done. Can you walk us through the process? How, how does it work? How do, how do you get involved with helping them bliss it up? So we have our own recommendations after we come through the home mm -hmm. that we would do, let's say if we were gonna buy it and flip it. Um, so what we're doing instead of us buying it and flipping it, we're gonna work with them as a partner and go through a list of items that we would suggest they're going to keep the property in their name. We're going to make those repairs. Um, we are paying for those repairs, my husband's company and myself, and we're gonna put it out on the market after those repairs are done. So I would be their listing agent as well. Once the home sells, we have our management fee and our cost repairs taken off at closing, but then any profit between the as-is price where the house was to where we you know, blist it up to, is a split between our company and the home seller. So they're gonna make more money than what they would have of just selling it as is. So it's kind of profit sharing. Exactly, <laughs> that's a good way to say. Well, we are right now at 2806 North Holton Avenue, right in the heart of Milwaukee's north side. And this particular home, why don't you tell us what you did here? I see the, the, the paint has been freshened up, that you've painted the woodwork, just to make it brighter, right? Yes. And, and is this home for sale? I would assume yes. it is. It is on the market right now. Uh, so you can contact me for that. But we also came in here, we did the paint, we refinished the flooring, we redid the bathroom. And then on the exterior, we made sure all the paint is fresh and clean and there's no chips and it's all a financeable property. Is there a specific style you go for in, in a blissed home so that it can be maybe perhaps more compatible with whatever furniture the new buyer would right. bring in? Well, this particular home, we refinished the floors to be a more of a grayish instead of the traditional, you know, old, look, old oak look, I should say. And then we did like a real neutral gray on the walls and then did white on the woodwork um, just to brighten it up, freshen up and someone can come in and you know put their th things in, can visualize their, their things in here. Um, I did not stage this one, although that's an option, but we did not stage this one. Who is the ideal customer partner to work with in the Just Blissed program? What are you looking for? So we're looking for anyone who has what's 
called an unsellable home. Maybe they tried selling it and they got a lot of feedback um, or failed inspections that they're just not getting that home to sell. So that's a great candidate right there. Um, another is maybe someone acquired a home through a death or um, of mom that moved to a facility and they have this outdated home and they don't know what to do with it. I'm happy to give them options. Is there anything else that we haven't asked you about Just Blissed that our viewers need to know? No, but you know, give me a call. I'd be happy to talk through it with you. Um, we can offer a cash offer. If that doesn't work, we can do the Just Blissed partnership or I can do a traditional listing. Thank you, Missy. It was great talking to you again. And again, the program is called Just Blissed. Thanks for watching.